We don't know how to run a double elimination bracket. I think. Okay, so right over here we have the Mario Brothers team. That's Kumamaru and Shimon against Hipster and Egg Mode, who are Fox and Pikachu, respectively. Respectively. Yeah, and this this is a high powered doubles match. Yeah, so like, I, I I'll tell you, my personal pick for this is Team Mario and Shimon, simply because I think that they're going to have a better teamwork and better spacing. Hipster and Egg Mode, I don't I don't think have played together that much. The, and the other I, thing, when I was watching them earlier, I felt like they were going for a lot of just sort of hit them and hit them again, and they, they didn't quite have the, the teamwork and sense of spacing a stage to control that, that I was seeing from uh, Kimi Mario and Shimei. Well, we also right have now, here. Though, we have yeah. great oh. team in, in very good stage position. Yes. And they have Shimon off stage. Yeah. Shimei is amazing. Very, very tricky. And uh, an egg mode a visitor from SoCal, one of our friendly neighbors. Oh, that, that was a very clean editor. Ooh, but that, that almost helped a little. Luigi. And, and also, I, I want you all to keep an eye out for, for the Luigi here. He does this thing, it, we, we call it the Shimon, where he does the get up off the ledge into up B. Oh, so no. if, if we don't see people respecting expecting the space you're, you're bound to see a Shimon. Yeah, the, the, the neutral the neutral get up so it's up B. Very nice. Shiman. Uh, can he clinch it? Very nice uh, tornado there. Interesting choice. Oh yeah. He was going for another edge guard with a second up B but it didn't quite make it. Okay so we'll, we'll see oh the dash attack very interesting. That was all oh, that you can oh, see wow. that uh, Kimimara was going for the safety fireball to protect against uh, She-Man getting the hit and it just barely missed. Ooh, and then the hard read up smash. It might have been reaction. Kimimara likes likes the up smash and he likes to right. hit with just the very last, most forward hitbox on the hat. Very good spacing here. But right now, Green is in the center stage and they have the bros spit up. But well, just yeah, as but soon as I say it, yeah. In the time it takes to say it, the situation is reversed. Oh, well, you know, when you're doing all oh, teams, bad team Greenland. hit from Kimimaro. I was, and Kara was just talking about Blue Team's uh, excellent spacing, and Kimimaro goes hitting his uh, hit his teammate to death. And, and, and you see him still try to recover. You know, sometimes in teams, it's actually better if you know you're not going to be able to recover. Just kill yourself. Just yeah. kill yourself and get back. Exactly. Just that, that reduce fast, the amount of time faster. that your teammate has to do a two-on-one. Yeah. Given the egg mode was across the stage, that would have been the, the right option, I think. Otherwise, Pikachu could have just thrown thrown a, a Thunder Jolt down, thrown down a neutral B, and tried to save him. And that was actually a very excellent fireball by Kimi Morrow. I'd like to point that out off the Angel platform. L late, sending in the reinforcements for his boy, Shiman. And uh, right now, it's, a, it's about oh. as tied up as it can possibly be. Ooh, so it's going to be a little more even. Great recovery. I, I have to say so. Oh, they were setting... Save. No, they were going for a cool guy team combo, but it didn't quite work out. We see She-Man hold, holding ledge, trying to keep it free for, uh, for his partner. Pikachu forced to be preventing him from uh, covering the ledge further. Oh yeah, Kimi Morrow there, struggling to get in to help She-Man. Oh wow, the She-Man forward, forwarder, very odd spacing on that. Oh, this is exactly what Green Team needs. Does he have his jump? He does have the jump. Oh, oh that the was fireballs. He was trying to help him. He was, he was, but but it ended he, up really he didn't know his recovery. He didn't know that his teammate still had the jump. That, yeah. That's the deal. He thought that he was going to up B and they give him a second up B, but instead he uh, he killed him. No but good. still, you know what? I'll, I'll take that as great awareness from, yeah, from his Kimi his Mario. heart his heart was in the right place yeah. to be sure. Not you know not not a lot of Mario's would try for that. Yeah. We have here, you know, probably four of the best players at our venue here tonight. Oh yeah, I I think in in singles. I'd be very surprised if uh, you didn't see a lot of these names late in the top eight. Yeah. And, yeah, wow, oh, what a close match here. I would expect you know, all four of these players to You want to watch because Mario's about to go. He's at uh, 165. All you have to really do is, is, is touch him. Well, another split edge guard. Kimi Mario gets back. That's huge. So does Hipster. Will it? Wow. Fair, not quite enough. Green team wow, fantastic. is in a and, position. Oh, wow. Yeah. And blue, blue team. Oh, blue team's still in this. down to be a one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, and oh, there it the is. the Shimon. That was the Shimon. And that was exactly what he needed. Oh, wow. wow. 
Shiman. What a crazy finish. Oh, Shiman able to clinch it out with Very Luigi. Juicy combos. <laughs> I don't know if those are combos. Those are just strong oh, no. raw hits. Yeah. And you see Eggmode and Hipster keeping it, keeping it even. Kimimaro and Shiman showing uh, showing a few holes in their in their team's chemistry. Very clutch. Very clutch moves with the up the end. Yeah. All right. Yeah, so going into it, we see green team giving uh, giving blue team a fair bit of respect, and blue team with patience on the approach. Oh, missed Z cancel. And again, we see split edge guards Ooh. in both teams. Oh, oh wow. yeah. I, I understand why he did that, but in retrospect, it was the right thing to do. Great combo, Ki yeah, Kimimaro, Kimimaro, but it's not going to kill. Yeah, and the, and Kimimaro knew that he could go through with that combo because he saw that Shiman had Fox in the combo. Ooh. I thought Pikachu has something going there. Man, I, and I'm really liking the, the spacing from Blue Team right there. Ooh, and, and you, you see Kimimaru go for that down B. Uh, I've seen him do that for the spike. Oh, it's the not, spike. It's not Luigi's uh, down B, which, which is a great finisher, but if they're off stage in Mario, you can you can hit him with a uh, particular hit of the down B. Yeah, it's, it's the very last hit of the down B. And he's the only one on the stage, the yeah. lone survivor. Five stocks, they're going to be looking to take one of the stocks very soon. And to be honest, you know, the, the right there's someone has five stocks. For an interference. It's demoralizing. Oh, he's got both of them in the combo. Yeah, that, that was, that was the right thing to do, though. Yeah. yeah he, he didn't finish the combo because he, he would have ended up comboing his teammate. But he started the combo to get him out of one. And that, that, was, that was just really good. It was a really good screen that, that Kimimaro laid down there for G-Man. And again, we're starting to see both teams sort of have a, have a guy on point and sending him out in front yeah. and having a guy uh, hanging back. Which, which I think is, is, general, is generally pretty good team spacing. Kimimaro committing to the edge guard, but a very good target switch there to, to keep it safe for him. And, and again, finishes. he just fishes it out. He knows what he's doing with that. Wow, Kimimaro and Shiman up by three stocks. Nice little lead right now. Indeed. I, I think that now is about the time where Green Team's going to want to start putting in some work. That's a great start. 2v1 situation. Let's see if they can make something. And we'll Looks like back. they weren't quite able to set up the, the cool team combo. Oh, wow. And again, we have sort of a 2 1 v oh, ones here. Oh, this is bad. Nice little witch for the tech. Yeah. Bad awareness by Eggmo. Oh, that forward air. And here we go. Kimimaro, excellent. Excellent uh, interference for She-Man. Oh, wow. Yeah, and She-Man there hold, holding the ledge with his invincibility and then, so that he could get off of it. very Kimimaro. last second. I thought he was going right to the Oh, that, that was a beautiful up smash from Kimimaro. I think it's a pity that it didn't quite right it. And She-Man there still had his jump. She-Man so good at hanging on to that jump. Let's see. Oh, that was a North Carolina guard if ever I've seen. Yeah, you know, actually, I think Hipster's recovery is just too good. Hipster's recovery is very good, but the thing is Fox... Fox has a pretty linear recovery once once you once you have it figured out. Ooh, and he's, and he's really living. Yeah, right there. He he was able to turn it around pretty nicely. Now now if Shiman can, can tackle some damage before losing this stock, it's gonna be a very, very difficult, difficult throw for the green team. A absolutely. And Luigi Luigi lives for a long time. Especially if he has someone to lay down interference for him. Ooh, but you saw he was able to, to shut down that right there. She man, no, yeah, she she man there was very nice running interference on Fox, walling Ooh. walling out hipsters so that Kimi Mark could concentrate on an edge guard. Oh, oh wow, hipster just a little too low, and now All right, so egg now, mode. So now we want to see them try to cool. put on a we, show. We, we, we want to see these guys style. They're they're yeah. up a lot. They're probably not going to lose. Yeah, see some style one way or another. E either a cool team combo or an something standing one v two comeback. Yeah, but. From what I've seen from Shiman and Kimimaru, Egg Mode, I think that, it, that the hill is too steep. Oh, that was a good up B to get out of there, but it's really like... the only option. Yeah. And now they're just playing with them. Well, I, I think no, a forward throw may that. have done it. Oh, uh, you're right. They were he trying, probably trying was, yeah. to, to like, throw him into an up B or something like that. Now, now his percent's too high. In fact, yeah. All but right there, Shiman forcing Egg Mode to, to, for the respect so that he can't get even a, a single stock in the 2v1. 
That's where we were. Oh, oh that's, that's going to be it. All right, so he does manage wow. to get one stock in the 2v1, but but all in all, that that was a that was a convincing performance from Kimi Mara and Shiman. You know, all in all, not doing anything too flashy, just being really solid. No, this, this is winner's set. Is this... Oh, God. I don't know what's going on. Ooh, we have a character switch. We have yeah. egg mode going Yoshi. And you'll notice his name He's is egg going mode. egg mode, I guess. He is very People much. have made that joke probably before. Well, I mean, I I understand that bad. that he calls himself Egg Mode because he uh, he played he was he was originally a Yoshi main, and I, I believe he plays Yoshi in both 64 and Melee. But recently in, in 64, he's been uh, playing Pikachu. What a scumbag! And here again, Kimimaro opting just to, to lock Egg Mode down instead of trying to run interference on Shima. And now Blue Team is in uh, a good great position. Great by Kimimaro. Yeah, Shima. Do it, playing nice and safe, just being a threat there for Yoshi. Yeah, I letting don't, Kimimaro do his thing. So, so, what do you think about this Yoshi counter pick? I mean, it, it, I guess it, it looks like they don't really have an answer with, with Pikachu. Um, I guess the Mario Brothers, though. I don't know. Very nice jab, jab up smash from Hipster. Uh, I I think it makes a lot of sense given that uh, Eggman's Yoshi is, is relatively new. Wow, what an, another give one of Hipster by Kim Oh my gosh. And also given that um, this this being Winners Finals is actually best of five. So oh, e yeah, even so. if the Yoshi doesn't work out, they, they have a chance to adjust things a lot. Have, wait, haven't, haven't, haven't you played twice? Yeah, so this is game three. Oh, that's true. Yeah, this, might, this is game three. Here, let's uh, update. All right. In the, in the double edge guard, they're, they're able to clinch one. Not quite able to get Shiman. And here's Kimimaro. Excellent down air laying down the interference. Both green teams in, in the up smash. And now we've, we've got very excellent double edge guard. Except Shiman she -Man trade, trades a stock for it, but they have it, a, enough of a, of a lead that he can easily afford that. Right. Ooh. And she -Man, he really get back. No, no, not quite. But, but it was worth it. Exactly. That's, uh, in fact, the... Ooh, wow, he off of the angel great, platform great before his invincibility had run out. He just ran in there. And what spacing not to hit Kimimaru. And again, oh. another great wait for the fireball. Yeah. Wow, these guys are playing yeah. out of their minds, to be honest. I, you might even... Uh, this is some of the best teams play we've seen tonight, I think. You uh, you might see these guys actually teaming uh, in Snowsuit if, if, if Kimmy's able to come. I know both these guys are looking for teammates, and uh, yeah, I, mean, I, I kind of like them as, yeah, as Mario Brothers. Sick Perry! Now, this Mario Brothers team is looking really fresh. And now, once again, it's all up to Egg Mode. He's got to trade one for six this time. And you can see a lot of the times... Oh, sick DI! <laughs> that was amazing DI from Kimi Mario. And they're... No, no butt oh. spike. But, oh, he, he super armored it. And the Kimimaru. And and very nice, as we like to say, wow. keep it in house. Wow, that was um, that, that was, was that, something to see. That that was a statement right there in game three. Kimimaru.